for a muse of fire that would ascend the brightest heaven of confusion, a car park for a stage, emerald guards to act, and cashy heads to behold the missing teeth. Imagine when we talk of winners that you actually get to see them, banging their proud noses on the muddy earth, for tis your laughs that now must deck our players, carry them here and there, jumping over all kinds of rubbish, squeezing the accomplishment of many years into a sweet leotard. Admit me, great Charles, to this history, that I might humbly pray that you gently watch and kindly judge our game. Cry havoc and let slip. It's time for Takeshi's castle. What mighty general's this, that so far from Albion's shores has gathered here a legion of warriors, knights and common men together to leap with lion's hearts over perilous monsters of the sea, across dizzying heights and into icy depths, that some might crawl from those adamantine gates of hell to reign justice on the count and his emerald guard. Onward, general! To the fruits of victory and spoils that lie beyond. It slipped discs, come on! <laughs> oh, it's the game, of course. Keep your head down. Save your ring from penetration. We've got 100 contestants here, only 88 places in the next round. That means a dirty dozen are going out of this very early stage. They've flown from near and far. It's a matter of pride. They don't want to go out just yet. Back on the bus. They all look better in slow motion. Keep your head down, look, come on, keep your head down. Save it all, director. Getting a little bit cosy with his camera there. Emerald Guard, highly accurate. Very well trained. They live and sleep. Well, don't we all? Two paths diverge in a wood and maze. And I, I took the ones less travelled by. If only our contestants had done the same. It might have made all the difference. Honeycomb maze. Look how slippy the floor is. Proceed with caution. Avoid the guards, the beasts of the maze. Get from one side to the other without ending up in the drink. Come out the door that leads to dry land and you go through. Oh! Look at the floaters in there. Absolutely disgusting. The steam coming off it. Raw, untreated sewage. Strange, really, because they're such a clean people. Getting down and dirty today, though. Come on, love, you have to move quicker than this. You're going to get trapped by the black-handed, black-hearted guards. Oh, no, body swerve. Body swerve. Oh, she's trapped now, though. They've got her by the jumper. She's getting away. It's a cat and mouse game, this. I can't believe she's going to make it. She's going round in circles and of course she isn't going to make it at all. In the drink, back on the bus, back to Matron with the warm milk and biscuits. What's he come as? To the butcher. Is it his head on the block? Oh, he's going cautiously but he's going in the right direction. Oh no, wrong door! Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Here we go. He's dressed in yellow, he ain't no coward. It takes bravery, some would say madness, to play to Keshi's castle. And of course, lots and lots of medical cover. Oh! Pushed him through there. Somehow, I don't think animals taking it seriously today. This lad is though. <laughs> he slips. For sure, nonsense. 
very Shakespearean. Oh, is he going through now? Wrong door again. Ends up in the drink. All up his nose. Everything. That's what you need. A couple of scotches before you enter the maze. This commentator, of course, on a whiskey diet. He lost three days last week. Bum bum. She cornered. <laughs> Can't get cornered in the round room. And now the black hands. <laughs> it's like a night round at New Hefner's. There's the black hand coming out. Her face is blackened. Her reputation blacker. What? Few tears in the eyes. She doesn't want to go back to the hospital. Very strange tattoo. This is the phantom of the honeycomb maze. I just hope he doesn't sing. We've all heard karaoke. Oh, come on, we haven't got all day. Sneaking around like a burglar. Come on, lad. <laughs> oh, good body swerve, though. Go in the right direction. And then comes out the wrong door. <laughs> you don't want to put your head under, mate. Just for my flush. Yeah. Oh, come on, he's back and he's scurrying like a big. Bad sense of direction, though. Straight in. Two animals grasp. Good man. Oh, we're gonna dump him head first into the drink. Tea break over. Back on your heads. Ugh. Animal, sadistic as usual. It's like medieval torture. My ridiculous replay, though, has got me this nervous little chap. Out, damn spot, and stick yourself on a hot watch. In Xanadu did Kubla Khan a stately pleasure dome decree. But it wouldn't have lasted long in Quake. I'll tell you that. Still don't know about the wigs. Maybe they're just in disguise, so their friends and family don't know it's them. We've got fallers already. It's like the Grand National of Games, this. What's he opening his shirt for? All two survivors, they'll go through. Gotta be happy. Not as easy as it looks. But, but more stupid. There we go. Building to start to move. We have a faller. One at the back's gone as well. The windows are breaking. Furniture's falling off the walls. Three survivors. I don't think this is shake, rattling and rolling as much as it used to. Seems to have slowed down a bit. What's that kimono on the left? Somewhere in Japan, there's a Renault Clio without seat covers. Look at it. Falling apart, he's just got it in the nose and think he ain't happy. Here we go. <laughs> Porky went straight away. He's bringing them all down with him. Hey, look at the tash. Lovely, sir. Like Tom Selleck in Magnum. Oh, but he's firing blanks. And he's fired out the competition. Ridiculous replay time. Soft one out through yonder doorway breaks. It is the East, you know. And they don't like home wreckers. Call him Hishmael. And look sharp, all of you. There are whales hereabouts. It's wipeouts. Oh, he looks very Japanese. He's a ninja assassin. And he's just committed harikari. <laughs> He's out the game. Before I can tell you the rules. You get on the board. You hang it in. 
Of the, the whales onto the ledge, of the whales onto the ledge, and you go through. What you've got to do? Yes, okay. Is avoid okay, the okay, white box. Okay. 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 Ridiculous replay time in this okay. Eastern okay. Ahab nearly okay. defeated his wailing enemies. But like his namesake, couldn't quite make it back to dry land. He won't be making the return journey in part two. When we're hitting our high brows on the high rollers. Getting cold and wet in the rice bowl downhill. Knocking some stuffing out in dominoes and meeting in the middle and bridge the gap. Parting is such sweet sorrow, but dry your eyes, we're back in three. Well, welcome back to part two, Heads of Keshi. And remember kids, there's many a slip, twix, cup and lip, but even more in the high rollers. Yeah, mate, come on. Stuck in confidence. But he ends up doing the road runner. In the drink, back on the bus, in shame. Took it there, nearly snapped it off the lad. It's in the rules though, it's official, you can't snap it off. Oh. He's got to recover from this position. It's fairly impossible. But what do I know? He's doing the caterpillar, trusted technique. Get on with a good recovery, oh no! It goes down, nice somersault at the game. Alright, come on Porky! Plump returned and Porky! He's comfortably round! He's doing the caterpillar! Oh! Maintain helicopter cover at 500 feet, we've got a casualty! Looked like it really hurts! Oh, what? What an experience! What a recovery! What a victory! Come on, don't blow it now! Yes, she goes through! Doing well for the ladies! He looks like a happy chappy! <laughs> Not happy anymore! Oh, well, bears it all with good grace! Look at that! Bangs off the roller. Looks like it hurt quite a bit. Oh, a bit of speed. Not a bad technique. Can she recover? The momentum. I'm sure we'll take her down. She can't get a footing. It looks like she's going to end up going through the mangle. Oh, yes. Oh, Captain, my Captain, rise up and hear the bells. It's my ridiculous replay. Can't rise once he's fallen. And the only bells he can hear is the ringing in his ears. It's getting chilly out there. Now is the winds of our discontent. And it's not helped by throwing yourself into the freezing slurry at the bottom of the rice bowl downhill. They're dressed like dumplings, the Emerald Guard. Is this contestant going to be a noodle? Well, she gets poured all over the tablecloth. And even the baby gets wet. She's out. Who doesn't think that's a real baby? There's a mark of madness about the contestants. You have to distribute your weight. If you end up in the drink, even at the bottom, you're out. You go out. Stay in the bowl at all times. Are you sure about those specs, mate? Look at the plumage. The Emerald Guards strutting like proud peacocks. But our contestant isn't. He's going down on his back. <laughs> like a sweet and sour brawn. Up the game, lad. He just got the sour. Wait a the Japanese 
Chinese woman in my soup. Can she stay at all? Some get some of that. Some get some of Doesn't quite know where she is. Checks the head to see if it's on. Oh, he's out the bowl before he's made the soup. Bye bye, baby. Oxygen. Well, you can't breathe underwater, love. Let's have it. Not sure about the ceremonial dance. Wait, distribution seems good. Oh, now she's gone up to one side. Can she pull it back? Yes, she can. Well done, lady. Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, yes. Time for my ridiculous replay, and this courageous maiden made a truly valiant effort to stay the course. But she won't make it into the next round. A ball! A ball! My kingdom fought indestructible! There's a person in there. You wouldn't do it. You just wouldn't get me in. He needs to go to the hairdressers in. You only get into this ball if you're completely bonkers. The Emerald Guard putting in the boot, helping him down. Through the course! Don't hit the skulls! Oh! If you end up in the box of skulls, you go out the game. No matter, you're going to be very, very dizzy. And probably very, very sick at the end of this. Another one goes out. After all that effort, we're off the dominoes. <laughs> He's gone already. Oh, that's it. Good technique. Oh, he made it look easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. He's lost most of his teeth already, so he didn't care. Ooh, comes down heavy on his backside. Didn't really get started, did she? Looks like a general. He's a traffic warden. Here's the general. Look at that. The right boots. He could make it into Korea. Oh, that's the style. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Don't mess with me. I'm Bob Karen G. My ridiculous replay has to be the chunky chappy who squeezed himself into the army surplus uniform. How the mighty four. And I'm sure a fair few more will now because it's time for Bridge the Gap. Final round is Mawat the Komanechi. This gap. Oh, pathetic. Into the bath of white powder. Now, come on, across the bridge. You've got to get this right. The momentum is taking you one way, the bridge is going the other. You end up in the baking soda. At least you can bake yourself a cake. Scratching his chin. I'm not sure he knows the rules. Oh, and he completely mistimed it. Came down quite heavy. A woolly mammoth on his shirt. Quite sure. Oh, yes! Well done, lad! Well done. Onto the ledge and you've made it. Who said woolly mammoths were extinct? Love the kimono. Will be like the style. Oh, I'm not sure. You're not supposed to drink before the game. Keep off the sake. He's jogging on the spots. Limbering up. <laughs> and now limbering down. She's very happy. She's going to try her very best, Campari Mas. Come 
Come on across the bridge, you gotta meet it, you gotta get there faster than that, mate, come on! No! Go on, back to the YMCA. My ridiculous replay's gotta be this unlucky unfortunate, he did so well to get across. I've got nothing but a mouthful of used sound for his trouble. Let's take a quick look back in anger. The furious flashback. And see who else he'll be sharing the happy bus with on the long road home. Of course, some of these won't be going home for days. They'll be in traction. You daft Out of the game, into the soup. Oh, yes, well done, lad. We have a Grandmaster's Wait, Furious Five, five left for the final the showdown. Water cannon to the left of them. Water cannon to the right of them. Into the car park of death rode the quaking quintet. They that had fought so well came through the jaws of death, back from the mouth of hell. All that was left of them, left of 100, it's the charge of the flashing light brigade. Come on! And only five. It's going to be difficult. These are the elite troops. The closest guards to the count. Highly accurate, highly trained, highly Selassie. The ring gets penetrated on the front of the dinky dodge, it means. They're going home, they've come so far. 333, the number of the mini beast. Oh, that ring is gone. They've come this far. You're a busted flush, mate. That's it. No winners this time on Takeshi's castle. But if I should fall before I next return. Think only this of me. There is some corner of a foreign field that is forever absolutely bonkers. Sayonara.